Guys, in this video, we're going to take a look at how you can install and enable Google Keyboard or Gboard on your Samsung Galaxy S22 series. So first tap on the home button to go back to the home screen. On the home screen, swipe up to go into app screen. And in here, tap on the Play Store. Once you are in Google Play Store, make sure that you already sign in. And then we're going to search for an app called Gboard. This is the Google Keyboard. All right, so tap in Gboard and then tap on the Google Keyboard right here and tap on Install. And now we're just gonna wait for it to download and install the Google Keyboard. Okay, once it has finished installing, tap on the Open button and then tap on Enable in Settings. And here, tap on Gboard, tap on the switch here to turn it on. And it says Gboard may be able to collect all of the text you type, including personal data, such as passwords and credit card numbers. Just tap on the OK button if you agree, and then tap on Select Input Method. So in here, we're going to choose Gboard, and then tap on Done. If you want to add in additional languages, you can tap on Languages in here, and Add in, tap on Add Keyboard, and here you can select other languages as well. And in here, you can also change the theme of the keyboard. So you can see there are quite a lot of different themes that you could choose for your keyboard. This red, uh, this dark black, default dark, you got default and system auto. And in here, it has some other um, landscape uh, pictures on the background that you can also apply to your keyboard. Okay, and then you can go down here, there are more options as well. So that is the keyboard theme, and you've got the text correction. In here you can choose uh, which corrections to turn on or turn off. There's quite a lot of uh, different settings that you could choose. And you've got glide typing, you can turn on glide typing or turn it off. There's quite a lot of settings in here as well. And you've got the clipboard. Save with some screenshots in Clipboard. You can turn it on if you want to allow the screenshots to be placed into Clipboard. And then you've got other settings that you can uh, play around with. All right, so if you don't want to uh, share your usage statistics, you can switch it off. And then if we go back to uh, an, a text, so I'm going to open up a text messages. And in here, if I um, open up my keyboard, you can see this is the Google keyboard. So that's the Google Keyboard right there. If you don't like to use the Samsung Keyboard, you can install the Google Keyboard instead. And that's it. So that is how you can uh, use the Google Keyboard. Now later on, if you decide you want to switch back to the Samsung Keyboard, you can swipe down, tap on Settings. In Settings, you can go down and tap on General Management. Then in here, we go to tap on uh, the Keyboard. So Keyboard List and Default. And here you can choose which default keyboard you want to use. So tap on default keyboard. And in here you can switch it back to the Samsung keyboard. And that's it. So that's how you can switch it to your Samsung keyboard. Or you can switch it to your Google keyboard. Thank you for watching this video. Please subscribe to my channel for more videos.